Hello YouTube. Uh, let me reset the thing. Today I want to show you my Arduino project. I will leave the code in the description if you want to see how it's wired. It's really fucking simple. It's a button and an RGB LED. And it has to be an RGB LED or three LEDs of different colors or at least three LEDs. <laughs> Easy as that. Basically you wire them up like this or you use one of those things. If you have only one you use the you wire it to the negative pole instead of all the I notes. I mean positives. <laughs> right now it's in white mode as I call it. Or as the code says C colon space white. I mean W. Uh, as soon as I press this button, the code will change and the light as well. I mean, the thing will change in the light as well. Now it's blue. Now it's green. And now it's red. Basically, it's actually a BGR light. Because it's the opposite of RGB. <laughs> but who cares? If you want to fix this code, the only thing you have to do is leave the header alone. Yes, I am gonna. If you don't leave the header alone and don't credit me, I will take action. Because I want to be credit. credited. Because, well, I've written this code all by my own. So please credit me. Or actually, you must credit me if you use it, but feel free to make a video on it as long as you put this link in the description, it's all okay. But just don't put a, like, dox that shit out of him or some other negative shit because, well, that's a bad idea. Then I still take the video down. Because YouTube does not allow that and other sites as well. I will take it in the card as well, that's, that's not a lot. So... This is basically it. Not a spammy button. But that has no effect. Because spamming the button has no effect because I had to put a long delay of one second. Could do it shorter, but I was too lazy to do that. So this is basically it. You could Change the code and wire or whatever the shit you want on this. Maybe even now you can do that. I mean, you can wire another microcontroller on it. For example, this thing. This is a microcontroller which you probably won't be using because this is an old piece of garbage out of a LED screen. Yep, <laughs> you're not gonna use this shit. But you can wire all kinds of stuff on that. I mean, maybe if you're handy, maybe I will make a second video on this thing, wire to that, like, if you get closer the lights get on or something, yeah, I can do a lot of things. <laughs> I can also change those file use, I did not use them, but, whoops. This is the RGB value, so you basically can make them brighter or less bright. Also, I forgot to mention, but you have to wire the LEDs to the analog pins because, well, the code is for analog only, as you can see. Analog right, analog right, analog right. You could. Technically, change all those analog writes to digital writes, uh, but then you won't be able to change this value anymore. So basically, you break the code, <laughs> and not in a good way. That's all they do. Only the button pin is digital, so you can change the button pin to whatever the shit you want, as long as you don't use an analog pin for that shit. 
Who's gonna use it anyway for, an, for a button? I mean, it's useless. I think there's like four analog pins. And a, like 13 digital ones, so using an analog one is just overkill and useless. Well, that's it. Good night. At least for me, it's night. Nice.